Ah, you've moved on to a part of the manor where another type of dimensional rift is accessible. This is the Gravid Wolfram dimension, or Heavy for short. This dimension is in direct opposition to the Fluffy dimension and will make things ten times heavier. He's a bit on the shy side. Give him some time to get used to you. Now just imagine how long it took me to lay all that out. Be careful. I'd help you, but I've honestly forgotten which dolly has hooked up the witch power converter.
Some dimensions are tightly bound together, like the one we're in right now, and also the fluffy and heavy dimensions. That red battery will provide enough energy to enable the IDS device to widen the heavy dimension rifts in this area. It appears this dolly got stuck on an infinite loop. How unfortunate. a large expanse of piles and pits filled with various random objects. No, not where you are. Here, in this confounded place. Are those hard candy? They're a little... fuzzy. Nice job. No, not really. With the increased density and higher melting points of items in heavy dimension, quadrangle laser beams are rendered rather ineffectual.
the increased density and higher melting points of items in heavy dimension, quadrangle laser beams are rendered rather ineffectual. With the increased density and higher melting points of items in heavy dimension, quadrangle laser beams are rendered rather ineffectual. Like most things in life, timing is key. I came across Ike some time ago, and he decided to follow me back to the manor. I believe Ike stole these and hid them at one point. He's rather fond of shiny objects. half bad. This was once the family cat, Lord Widget Pompadour Fluffington the Fourth, or Widget the First. Note that if you disrupt the blue beam, it should deactivate something. Note that if you disrupt the blue beam, it should deactivate something. unit needs a little bit of work. 
I'm not entirely sure how many BEVs of radiation that emits. Hope you're not looking to have children. Note that if you disrupt the blue beam, it should deactivate something. I'm not entirely sure how many BEVs of radiation that emits. Hope you're not looking at have children. love child between a tarsier and a vampire bat. I keep wanting to take it down, but he won't let me. This place is truly fascinating. That, combined with the fact that I have no clue how I was transported here, is certainly puzzling. It's mostly dark. Well, maybe not dark. Sort of twilight. I'm fairly certain Desmond there will come in rather handy. Thank you. 
cozy over there. I find the number three to be a very satisfying number. It's a Heatner number and the proper amount of scoops on an ice cream cone. Would have done it better myself. Not bad, though. You may remember some of my past inventions from previous trips. This is my ice gun, Freezy Ray Vaughn. I really wish I could do that. 